If you use Microsoft Planner to help you organize your projects, sometimes it can be useful to break a task down. So rather than having lots of very small tasks, you could have a task and you break it down using a checklist. And that's what I'm going to show you here. So here I am in Planner now, and this task is the one that I want to add a checklist to. So I'm working in board view, and um, I'm going to click onto the task. And if I scroll down just a little way in here, I get to this area, which allows me to build my checklist. If I click where it says add an item, I can enter my first item and then press enter on the keyboard, which will finish that one off and uh, create another new one for you. So I've added three items to my checklist. And uh, once I've finished, if I either press enter or just sort of click away, it tells me that zero out of three of my checklist items have been completed. Over on the right hand side, I'm going to tick this box to say show on card. So if we close this details box down, now when I'm back in my board view, looking at the card for this task, I can see those three checklist items on there. Zero out of three have been completed, but if I tick one of those and say that's now completed, it gets hidden from the, uh, the card within board view. And I can see down here that one out of three has been completed. To add more, delete any, change the order of the, of the items, I can click on the task, which takes me back into this box. And then in here, you can tick and untick things to say they're completed or not completed. You can even move to the left-hand edge of the task. You're looking for those little dots. And with the hand symbol, with my mouse, I can click and drag if I want to move the order of my checklist items around. If you wanted to remove a checklist item, you can just hover over and then over on the right hand side, choose to remove that checklist item. I'm going to close this box down again. And there we go. So zero out of two of my checklist items are complete. I find that those checklists really help me to manage my tasks. If you have any questions about this video or Microsoft Planner, or you would like to talk about some planner training for you or your team, please do get in touch.